There once was a boy named Carl Gauss. His teacher tried to keep all the kids busy one afternoon by having them find the answer to the sum of 1 to 100. Carl found the answer in less time than it would take to eat a cookie. Let's start with an easy example. If we write the numbers from 1 to 10 across the page, and then write the same numbers backwards below, we find the sum of each column is 11. The number 11 is repeated 10 times across, so 11 times 10 is equal to 110. Since 110 is double the correct answer, as we have added 1 to 10 twice, we divide 110 by 2 and get 55. This is the same answer we would get if we used a calculator. 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 plus 6 plus 7 plus 8 plus 9 plus 10 equals 55. That's sweet, like a banana. So back to adding 1 to 100. We see the same pattern here. Adding the first number with the last number will work out to 101. This same answer repeats 100 times, so 101 times 100 is equal to 10,100. Since this is double the correct answer, we divide by 2 and get 5,050. We can write a computer program to find the answer too. Type, 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 F1, ta-da! Of course, Carl didn't have a computer, and he was extra smart. So instead of doubling the numbers, he found an even shorter shortcut. Instead of writing the numbers twice, we write only half of the numbers across the page. Then we write the other half below backwards. Each column still adds up to 101, but now there's only 50 columns, so 101 times 50 is 5050. This was the super fast method that Carl used in class. Today we use a generalized equation like this one, which is called the arithmetic series formula to solve similar problems like this one. So let's say we want to add all the even numbers from 2 to 1000. Since there are 500 even numbers here, we write the formula like this. which works out to 250,500. We will use Excel this time to check the answer. Set counter to zero. Set tally to zero. Add two to counter. Add counter to tally. Click on the black box on the bottom right to copy the formula down. This is the first 50 patterns. In the new column, add two to counter. Add counter to tally. Copy formula from the left. Click on the black box on the bottom right to copy formula down. Copy the entire table number 2 and paste it 8 more times. And when you look at the bottom right tally, it shows the same answer, 250,500. Highlight, hooray! This wasn't the only pattern that Carl Gauss discovered. He also found patterns in algebra, astronomy, and physics. He even has a unit named after him. For more adventures like this, make sure that you and your friends subscribe to this channel and hit the notification button as well. Until our next adventure, goodbye! Whoop.